Turning to other news now, it was a murder that stunned a community. A vibrant 87-year-old grandmother killed and stuffed in the trunk of her car. Tonight, three years later, there is justice. Daniel French is found guilty of murdering Barbara Howe. Local 12's Anjanette Levy was there when the verdict was read. For seven days, Barbara Howe's family has listened to the gruesome details of her murder. Her daughters waiting for justice for their mother. She was just a beautiful lady. Um, I adored her. I'll never forget her. And I miss her every day. Daniel French had hoped his attorneys could convince a jury he only wanted to rob Barbara Howe, not kill her. There is no plan and purpose when Daniel French comes up here from Kentucky to kill Barbara Howe. French's attorney said the killing was an accident, but prosecutor Mike Moser said the killing was not only intentional, it was planned, and French posed as a maintenance man for Howe's retirement community to get into her home. If this defendant had no intention of harming her or killing her, his opportunity at that moment was to do what? Scoop right out the door. Moser said French provided investigators with details only the killer would know. He said Howe fought back. After listening to closing arguments, the jurors deliberated for just two hours before returning with their verdicts. We, the jury, find the defendant guilty of aggravated murder. French showed no reaction as the judge read the verdicts. His sister sobbed in the back of the courtroom. For Barbara House family, they were words they'd waited three years to hear. Profound anxiety when we heard the verdict came so quickly. We didn't know what to think. And then when they read the first count, it was just unbelievable relief. The case isn't over. The jury will decide next week whether French should be put to death for Barbara Howe's murder. In Hamilton, Anjanette Levy, Local 12 News. The sentencing hearing for Daniel French will start next Wednesday. Before the trial, he pleaded guilty to some other charges, including aggravated robbery, aggravated burglary, and gross abuse of a corpse.